Not your typical nine to five job. Many people dream of attending to a steady job with normal work hours and a reasonable commute, perhaps in the last cosmopolitan city. Others desire something else. Here are two people who knew from an early age that they didn't want to a typical nine to five job. With determination and tenacity, they manage to find worth in airs that they are passionate about. Stephen Winchens, wildlife photographer and natural conservationist. What did you want to be when you were growing up? As a child, I remember having it all figured out. I was go. I was going to be an ice hockey star during winter, a soccer star during summer, and a pop star during spring and autumn. Later on, I wanted to be an archaeologist, an explorer, and a photographer. How did you get started in your field of work? I was in love with the natural world from the start. I want to know everything about animals. At 13, I became passionate about birds and I still am. I also become passionate about other places, other countries, other cultures, and other languages. The horizon and anything beyond it Fair like a promise, not a threat. I started talking picture at 13, but it took until I was 25 before I started my own company as a photographer. Before that, I was trained as an army officer and as a metal worker. But after a wife, I realized that None of that rig was my thing. So, I became a natural to a guy at 22, taking avocado tourists all around the world and being paid for it. I was also a picture editor at a major work, major book publishing company. What inspired you? I feel very strongly about a number of things, human rights, Indigenous peoples, every space of rights, democracy, freedom, and tolerance. But the issue I have chosen to really go deep into and try to make a difference for is a natural conservation and the survival of our natural heritage. We must take better care uh, of and respect this ancient heritage of ours, not only for ethical reasons, but also for poor human reasons. We need our natural heritage to lead happy lives, to feel really joy, and to be able to understand ourselves. What has been your favorite experience in the field? There have been so many who human experiences, cultural experiences, natural experiences, camping among lions, touching a white polar, bear snows, sleeping in the rainforest, and waking up to the monkeys.